Next, let's crochet the leaves section here. Leaves are displayed in three forms, and for this part, we use autumn green yarn with a 2 5 mm hook, 2 0. Now, let's demonstrate the crocheting method for the large leaf here. First, we begin by working into a magic ring here. The first round consists of chain stitches, double crochet stitches, treble crochet stitches, double treble crochet stitches, and triple treble crochet stitches. Yeah. Watch my demonstration. Start by crocheting three chain stitches. Followed by one double crochet stitch. Yeah. Let's look at the double crochet method. Wrap the yarn around the hook once, then insert it into the loop, wrap the yarn and pull through. Wrap the yarn and pull through the first two loops in one go, then wrap the yarn and pull through the remaining two loops, completing the double crochet stitch. Next, crochet one treble crochet stitch, paying attention to my demonstration. Wrap the yarn around the hook twice, insert it into the loop, wrap the yarn and pull through. Wrap the yarn and pull through the first two loops. Then wrap again and pull through the next two loops. And finally wrap and pull through the remaining two loops, completing the treble crochet stitch. Continue with one double treble crochet stitch. Watch me demonstrate. Wrap the yarn around the hook three times, insert it into the loop, wrap the yarn and pull through. Wrap the yarn and pull through the first two loops, then again through two loops, and once more through two loops, and finally pull through the remaining two loops, completing the double treble crochet stitch. Then, crochet one triple treble crochet stitch. Yeah. Watch my demonstration. Wrap the yarn around the hook four times, insert it into the loop, wrap the yarn and pull through. Wrap the yarn and pull through the first two loops. Then again through two loops. And again through two loops. And again through two loops. And finally pull through the remaining two loops, completing the triple treble crochet stitch. Continue by crocheting one more double treble crochet stitch. One treble crochet stitch. One double crochet stitch. And then three chain stitches. Finally, perform a slip stitch into the loop, ending this round. Next, we will crochet the second round, which is composed of half double crochet stitches and double crochet stitches. Let me demonstrate for you. First, crochet three half double crochet stitches into the hole formed by the three chain stitches from the first round. Then, for each stitch in this round, Crochet three double crochet increase stitches here. Watch my demonstration. Crochet one double crochet stitch. Then in the same stitch, crochet another double crochet stitch. Continue by crocheting two more double crochet increase stitches here.
Next, in the same stitch, crochet one double crochet stitch and a CH3 picot. Let me show you. Crochet three chain stitches. Then pay attention, we go back to the two loops of the double crochet stitch, wrap the yarn and pull through it. Drag the front loop through the back loop, and our CH3 pico is complete. Then, in the same stitch, crochet another double crochet stitch. Follow this by crocheting three double crochet increase stitches corresponding to each stitch. Finally, crochet three half double crochet stitches into the hole formed by the three chain stitches from the first round. Perform a slip stitch into the loop of the first round to finish this round. Leave a 5 cm tail, tie a knot, cut the yarn to finish. The large leaf is now complete. You will need to crochet a total of 15 large leaves. Please complete the remaining 14 using the same method. Here. 